<laughs> Newcastle last night, I promise you, he was in a suit. <laughs> what happened? I, Look, I, I, tell you, I were in Newcastle. Somebody has to wear some clothes in Newcastle. <laughs> There's a pub across the road, which is an absolute belter. Britain's protection. <laughs> I, I feel I know all of you now. Don't, <laughs> don't tell anybody. I've fallen over in there that many times, I can't remember. I've been barred twice. Go on. Have you? It, it used to be either the Prince or the Princess of Wales. It's now called Bar Tap. Talk about a rough hole. The biggest women I've ever seen. They wouldn't have got in this chair. There's four of them. Sat round the table, they've got tattoos everywhere and pints of tetlis. They just sat there. And I've gone to the bar, I thought, hello, this is a bit tasty in here. And, uh, oh, she says, I know you, you're on the radio. I said, well, go on then, who do you think I am? She said, you're Jonathan Agnew, you are, I know who you are. I said, Terrific, are you really good, you? I thought, thank Christ for that. She could have filled me in, this one. So I've got me phone out. And I pulled Agassiz's number up. It's shocking, this. And I, I, give it, I said, take my number down, give me a ring in the morning. <laughs> He's bouncing around the media the centre. Media. There's a bloody woman <laughs> been ringing me. <laughs> she, was a, yeah, she was a bit keen, wasn't she? Yeah, she was a bit big and all. Right? <laughs> 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 oh, dear.